it's your boy down low back for another reply, but before then, let's talk about something that's going on in the music industry, man. So with the whole little Wayne lawsuit against Cash Money, man, some more documents done got leaked in which they're showing what he was supposed to have been making that Cash Money never paid him for, in which he was supposed to get 30% of everything that Drake was making, man. And that reminds me of, you remember those lyrics, man, you, like you signed to a rapper that signed to another rapper, signed to another rapper, how much money is you actually gonna make? I forget who actually spit that shit, but that shows how true that shit was. Also, Lil Wayne was supposed to get 49% of Young Money, in which Young Money is 100% under cash money. Very interesting shit, man, but anyway, on to today's reply. Today's reply is to that ludicrous featuring Big Crit. Come and see me, produced by Mike Will Made It, and you know what? This track is fucking awesome, man. Like, all-star caliber performances by everyone involved. This is one of those down south trunk rattling, riding ass songs, man, that they dropped specifically now because it's becoming spring and you know about that time that's when everybody wanna have the rider music be out there in the cars, be out there looking at the women and all that stuff, man. Very strategic. I love everything about this song, man. Anything you want is on here. Lyrics, flow, excellent beat, good hook, overall great track, man. That's what this is. And which I'm hoping that this is the last song to be leaked for the Ludacris album, man, because I'm hype enough right now to go out and get this motherfucker. But seeing as though the album dropping at the end of the month, it looks like they gonna try to leak the entire fucking thing, and I hate it when people do this shit. I mean, leave a little something for the imagination, dude, but overall, go out, download this track, man. Is that fucking good. But anyway, on to today's article from DownloadPass.com, and I'm just going to touch on some shit here, which we're going to go well in depth for the next video that I'm about to fucking post. See, I've been getting a lot of fucking hate mail on this Kendrick Lamar album for giving it a 6 out of 10. In which, instead of a second review, man, I'm going to touch on all of that shit on my second video of the day. But here, I just want to pose the question. Do you guys really like this fucking album? Or is it that you're caught up in the hype of it? And that you really just want is some new dope shit from Kendrick Lamar that you'll just take this. And I'm sure nobody's gonna come clean and say, I'm just along for the ride type shit, man. But I see that in a lot of people because this isn't the instant classic great album that everyone is trying to make it out to be. But I do respect people who actually like that shit though, man. But it's the people that's putting the extras on it for no fucking reason. That's what annoys me. But to be continued, more about that shit coming up next. I hope you enjoyed the show. You can follow me at Twitter up there, and you can go to downloadpads.com that's down there to read today's article.